everyone welcome back to my channel my name is Nicola and I'm from South Wales in the UK if you're new uh, if you've been here before then welcome back to you also um, I've just had an Iceland delivery now so what I'll do is I'll show you everything that I bought in our delivery and then at the end I'll tell you the total then so first of all I had a six pinter of semi skimmed milk then other fresh things I had then, I had a pack of these strawberries then, two for three pound they were. Um, I don't know why I didn't get anything else, um, but um, they look really, really nice. Uh, I don't think I've had strawberries from Iceland before, but they look lovely. So they were two pound or obviously two for three pound. Um, and then I had a pack of the wafer thin cooked ham then for sandwiches, for school and things. And then another one of these rustlers classic hot dogs was a pound then i haven't had these in a long time the kellogg's variety pack you've got eight little boxes of the cereal then uh frosties multi-grain shapes etc um i think different ones on the other side isn't it yeah cornflakes and poker pops so they were one pound 25 half price so got one of those for a change and then just bread wise then just needed some rolls for pack lunch and stuff so they were a pound for eight and then another loaf of this lovely tiger bread then which is really really nice nicer i think than any other tiger bread that i've had from other any other places so yeah so we keep buying that um and then got one of these big huge popcorn like buckets kind of things really uh it was two pound but it is if it says a much Oh, it says but they're gluten free as well if you're interested in that um how big is it oh 250 grams so yeah the sweet popcorn so yeah that's for well my son and husband and mothers are probably for football on saturday night um they're gonna be watching the, the football i'm i have no idea what football um <laughs> i'm not a football fan but they are, so my son asked if I could get him something like that. So seeing that, I thought that was perfect for them to share. And then I just got some of these chicken breast fillets then to go in burger buns then. Um, they were two pound for four. And then the same then, but these ones are hot and spicy. So two pound also for them. And this time I've actually got the three pizzas. So I went for three meat feast pizzas and yeah, as I said last time, you might have seen that I only had two somehow. I didn't put the third one in the basket. So these are three for five pound or they're two pound fifty each. So I've got the three this time. So that's great. And then I noticed these then. We haven't had these before and with them watching football and things, I thought these are a little bit, uh, a little bit of fun. So... 10 tender chicken breast shapes soccer stars so yeah i thought give them a go so they uh look like they might be good and then they were they three pounds i'm sure they were three pounds so yeah 570 grams so not too bad hopefully they'll enjoy them and then another bag of the hot and spicy chicken breast fillet strips they're three pound for those and then I've had these for a while, the Greg's sausage rolls, eight of those in the pack, and they were three pound fifty. So it's not bad, um, because they they taste exactly the same as you know when you buy them. Obviously, you know, cook them in the oven, but um, yeah, they're so nice. I mean, I think in the shop they like something like four for three pound. So when you think you got eight there for three pound fifty good as a little uh, little snack or something or make a dinner out of it so yeah got those for a change and then i got three of these medium uncle ben's curries then this is what i use when i do like my chinese kind of curry and i chuck some frozen peas in with it as well and obviously chicken breast and everything and uh oh probably that doesn't say uncle ben's on there but yeah they're all uncle ben's and they were on offer at a pound so that was good and then the only kind of 
naughtiest thing other than the popcorn, which is for their football, uh, was this Mars ice cream. These were down to £1.50. So, yeah, they had like these and Snickers and there was a couple of things. So I thought, oh, we'll try try some of these. I'm just stocking up the freezer with that, some ice cream, really. But, uh, yeah, the only thing that's getting eaten at the moment is uh, a couple of the Conetto kind of ones that I bought. But, yeah, so I might not buy any more for a while now, just because I'm just filling it up with all things like that and uh, I need space for, for proper food. So, plus, I do need a good sort out because if you're anything like me, things get to the bottom of the freezer and right to the back and things and you, like, find them and, like, you know, there's so many things I could be making meals out of and I'm still buying stuff. So, yeah, I need to have a good sort out of that and uh try and make some meals out of some other things so yeah and then the last things i had then was these 24 pepsi max were seven seven pound fifty this time and then 24 pack of the water then they are three pounds and that was everything that i had from iceland then so that came to 44 pound 85p but 50p for the bag so just over 44 pound really so we'll see what i spend now in tesco's um yeah it will be it will be a little bit over budget because i always spend over 40 pound in tesco's because otherwise they charge you there's a little bit of a charge in there and i well, i know i will be spending over 40 anyway but it won't be too won't be too bad this week i don't think so yeah are you trying to stick to a budget at the moment i'm interested in what you try and i mean there's five of us in the house um now so it's not too bad that i'm trying to keep it to like under 100 a week because if you said i spent 100 and that's 20 pound each so yeah so i'm uh curious if anybody else is trying to stick to a budget and what your budget kind of is for how many people as well and and how you manage like i know there's lots of things i could really cook from from scratch really but i'm not the best i'm not the best cook really um <laughs> but yeah so i don't think we're doing too badly but um yeah so that's it for today and um yeah you know, the tesco video will be up in a couple of days and see what the total life spent is then so Thank you again to all of you for watching and to all the new subscribers as well. Thank you so much for subscribing as well. And thank you to everybody that comments, likes, everything. If you'd like to subscribe, it's completely free. Um, just press the subscribe button. All it means is that you will get notified then through your YouTube thingy bob. Um, <laughs> it'll just tell you when, I'm up, when I've uploaded another video. I tend to put up two videos per week um, at the moment. So, yeah, I hope you're all okay. And I will see you very soon in the next video. So, take care. Bye.